Hello everyone, welcome to how to set up MIRC in Ubuntu 11.10 using Genome Shell through the Software Center. What you have to do is open up the Software Center. and type in a program called Play on Linux. It's a Wine front end and you need Wine to run Windows programs which MIRC is. So all you have to do is click install. The one in the repos is a little outdated but it still gets the job done. Just got to type in your password let it download and let it install. It's a pretty big download so it takes a while. So for convenience sake I clicked out my computer downloading and installing it for the most part. Right here that box popped out behind the software center so I didn't realize it for at least 20 minutes. And I'll just point that out in case that happens to you as well. But after clicking that agreement, it goes fast. You know it's done when that screen goes away. And right here I'm just typing in Play on Linux to make sure it's installed okay. And it looks like we're good to go. But a virtual box is a little laggy. So just click the top, tip in play on Linux for fast operation. Click enter instead of clicking. Click forward. It'll download updates. I don't see the point of this really, it just doesn't install any updates, it just tells you that there's a newer version. Uh, this can take a while too, so I sped it up. Uh, right here you just click add, go to the internet section and click on MIRC. There's two entries, I'm guessing one's a different version from the other, but the description doesn't say which is the newest or what is oldest, so I just pick the bottom one. Just got it put forward. Um, this is installing the Wine backend required for MRC to work. And now it's downloading MRC from MRC.com. And now the install for MRC pops up. Just gotta go through the motions, click next. I uncheck create a desktop icon because usually that does not work. And I don't want to run it now because there's still a wizard that you have to go through. I click that for convenience. These icons do work. Just click forward till you're done. Now you see it's listed. Move that to the side. Um, right here I'm clicking to make sure it's executable because .exes are not executable by default in Linux and it is so that's just even more convenient. Just got to click, click continue, enter in some details. I just enter in holy cow for everything and eventually I pick a random server and I connect to it just to test it's working. Right here it's telling me there's a newer version. I'm just going to ignore that. And it's connected. 
I'm scrolling through this uh, prompt, picking a random room that nobody happens to be in, and typing random words, and it works. So I'd like to thank everyone for watching, and remember you can use this program to install other Windows programs. Thanks.